So, you finished watching the first half of ReZero Season 2. Congratulations! Now you have two options going forward with the story. You can either A, wait until January and watch the second half of the season as it airs, or B, read the web novel or a light novel. Either choice is fine, but it all comes down to a matter of preference. If you choose option A, well, I'll see you in January because I don't have anything left for you here. If you choose option B, however, I'm here to help you out so it doesn't seem too intimidating because I was a little lost at first too. Now as you may or may not know, the web novel is way ahead of the anime currently. Season 2 will cover all of arc 4 while the web novel is nearing the end of arc 6. Now yes, arc 4 is pretty huge and arcs 5 and 6 aren't that size, but still, there's a lot of story here. Before I get into web novel specifics, let's talk about the light novels. You can purchase the light novels pretty much anywhere. Books are usually sold. I'd recommend Amazon or Barnes & Noble or somewhere like that, but I'll leave that part up to you. Each volume costs about $14. The light novel is essentially a cleaned up version of the web novel and is considered canon. The only downside to the light novel is that the English translations are pretty behind as well. The most recent volume is volume 14, which will be available for purchase October 20th. This volume is still within arc 4, as volume 15 will be the conclusion to the arc. This means if you go the light novel route, you still won't even be able to finish arc 4. So you're faced with another choice, go a little ahead by reading the light novel and then stop, or finish it off with the web novel. So let's talk about web novel specifics. The web novel is completely free and all online, which is a plus. It's a little less refined than the light novel and can be considered a rough draft of sorts, but it's still good and will of course be the most up to date. There are a few good sites out there that translated chapters into English, but the one I recommend is Translation Chicken. Once you find Translation Chicken, go to the ARC 4 tab. Here, you'll find a table of contents for each chapter. As you'll probably notice, many of them are split into parts, but it's all the same. If you want to pick up right where part 1 of season 2 left off, then start at chapter 86 titled Against All Odds. Now unfortunately, Translation Chicken only translated up to chapter 110, so once you reach that point, you'll have to transfer over to a site called Witch Cult Translations. The reason I recommend you start with Translation Chicken is because I think his quality is better, but you can do what you want, I suppose. Either way, you'll end up at Witch Cult Translations to finish the arc. So there you have it, that's my guide on how to read ReZero after the first half of Season 2. I personally am not caught up and will be starting at the same place as you, since I've been mainly in anime only. Oh, I forgot to mention that there's a ReZero manga, however, it's adapted from the anime, so it's not really worth reading unless you absolutely love manga or just want to experience the story in a different format. Hopefully this video is able to help someone out and give a starting spot on where to go from here. Thank you all for watching, take it easy, and I will see you next time.